Hi, it's Kathleen Packett, and today is day 23 of our Internet Lifestyle Network video challenge. Today I've had a special request to do a tutorial on how to get an app on your phone, and this particular app that they wanted was Audible. So if you have never downloaded an app before, which is the case of, of a customer that um, I had today that asked me to do this tutorial, is you can do it one of two ways. You can do it from your phone. You can go to the app store on your phone and look for your Kindle app and your Audible app in, in your app store. If you're on an iPhone, you go to your, your uh, Apple Store. If you're on an Android, you've got two places that you can go. You can go to your Amazon App Store or you can go to your Play Store. But if you're not sure where those are, if you don't know where they are on your phone, you can come to Audible dot com slash sw and I will put the link down below a clickable link so it'll take you right to this page and the first thing you want to do set up your Amazon account if you don't already have one and do your audible account via your Amazon account because then they are linked they have the same card the same login same same everything that way it makes it very easy, especially when they have this feature that's called WhisperSync, which I'll get to in a minute. But first you want to find your app, which you can click on these and it will take you to where you can find your app. The iTunes iPhone one takes you to your iTunes, iTunes store. But you can go to the Apple store on your phone if it doesn't already have the audible logo. But the Android, if you have an Android phone and have Androids most usually always come with this on it, but if they don't, this will take you to you can click on these, takes you to the app store, or you can scan this, if you have your scanner on your phone, and it will take you right to that app. Very cool. And you can see that they have a Windows Phone mobile store. So then once you've got that app downloaded, under your account, there's tutorials also. I want to do that before I get carried away here. So you want to open that. When this is open, whatever device you've got, there's a quick little tutorial here that takes you through it so that you can see exactly how Audible works. You can go into Amazon find a book that you like or you can go to audible.com and buy a book that you want to listen to they as as the Kindle books or with audible they've got a little preview so that you can listen to see if you like the sound of that person's voice that's that's doing the book I often do that because some people's voices I that just don't jive with me so the cool thing is you can have these on multiple devices once you've bought the book and as long as your devices all have the same login, you've used your same Amazon account to set up the uh, Audible and your Kindle, you, you've logged into those with that account, then you can download any of the books onto any of your devices. So you can have it on three or four devices at the same time or multiple devices, whatever you've got. You can have it on your iPad, you can have it on your Android phone, you can have it on your iPhone, you can have it on your computer. It's really cool because wherever you are, you've got it. And with the audiobooks, books, because they, they download, when you're traveling or when you're out walking, you don't need Wi-Fi because it's been actually physically downloaded and you can, you can listen to it as, as you go without having to worry about a data plan or anything like that. So um, that's basically it. It's pretty quick. And uh, if you have any questions, private message me, get a hold of me, 
I'm more than willing to help you if I've left something out of this.